This is Dr. John Tantillo asking, did you know that Betty Lamar was one of the legendary beauties of Hollywood's golden age? MGM's dazzling star who was responsible for Samson and Delilah, the highest grossing movie of 1949 and decades of hits. But there were brains behind the beauty. You see, Hedy Lamar had an interesting history before she reached the silver screen. Her first husband, Frederick Mandel, was a European arms manufacturer. Hedy was his arm candy. He forced her to accompany him to his every meeting. Eventually, she ran away to America, but what Mandel didn't realize was that Lamar was listening and learning about the science of weapons, aided by her brilliant mathematical mind. On the eve of World War II, determined to help the Allies defeat the Germans, Lamar and a composer friend had a revelation. Discussing the problems of how the enemy could jam radio-controlled torpedoes, They developed a sophisticated system to solve it that used the mechanics of the player piano. Unfortunately, the U.S. military dismissed their idea. Lamar was just a starlet after all. What could she possibly know? As it turned out, plenty. By 1962, the military had recognized Lamar's smarts. Her idea was called frequency hopping. And it is a critical part of everything from cell phones to intercontinental missiles to your computer's wireless network. And now you can say, yes, I know that.